In this video, we're going to discuss where it is permitted to drill holes in a wooden joist. Firstly, we need to measure the total span of the timber, and in this example, we're going to use 3 meters or 3,000 millimeters. The allowed drilling zones fall between 0.25 and 0.40, the total span of the joist. So 3,000 times 0.25 equals 750, and 3,000 times 0.40 equals 1,200. So between 750 and 1,200 is the area in which we're permitted to drill. Now let's look at the drilling area in a bit more detail. There's also a limit on the diameter of the hole which can be cut, which is 0.25 times the depth of the joist. In this case, that will be 25 mil. 100 millimeters times 0.25 equals 25 mil. But in the on-site guide, it states that a cable not having an earth metallic covering should have at least 50 mil between the outer diameter of the hole and the top and bottom of the joist. In this example, this is not possible as the joist is only 100 mil in depth. So in this case, we would have to provide something to protect against penetration from screws and nails, of which here is an example. The distance in between these holes should be three times the outside diameter of one of the drilled holes, which is 75 mil. Three times 25 equals 75. The information presented in this video was sourced from the IET on-site guide page number 81. And if you found the information in these videos useful, please like and subscribe for more content.